am too. It's a lot more easier now. I don't know why. It feels like I'm more like used to myself. Do you feel more home? Yeah. yeah. I yeah. I did you feel like that earlier? Yeah, now I feel scared. Do you? No, I, don't. Feel... <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I've seen this backdrop so many times. So many times. times I, I feel very home. at home. That's why I did it in that corner once and I was like, the lights. I liked that corner did one. You? Yeah, I did. I think once I get the lights. Yeah. It'd be grand. You don't right. all these windows though. It's very true. Look how filthy they are as well. That's my window up there. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back today with Luke again. Again. <laughs> Round two. <laughs> and today we are back with a classic, a YouTube classic. It's a What's, What's in, in my, my bag? bag? Yeah, I'm really excited. I'm I mean, watching these. Do you? Yeah, I'm quite nosy. So. Yeah, I'm really nosy. It's wicked. I love it. I like to see what's in people's bags. Yeah, and then kind of like maybe think what I'm carrying that I should be, or like whether I carry too much. I think I've got a lot of stuff in my bag. I'm not gonna. I'm lie. quite interested to see what's in your bag. Mm. Yeah, should we do it? Let's should we do it. One? Right. Yes, you go first. Okay. Well, we'll show you my bag first of all. Um, those of you who read my blog, I think it's on my blog. It's somewhere or Instagram. Will have seen this already. So this is a bag that I got in Coach. Um, and I got this in the coach store in Cheshire Oaks, um, oh. which have some good deals. I thought you got it in Regent Street. See, no, I no, something that yeah. I've learned something. So the thing is, um, with these bags, wherever you buy buy them, whatever coach store it is, you can go into the flagship store in Regent Street to get your uh, monogramming done mm. or your tag. It is a beautiful bag. I'm kind of really jealous. Mine's <laughs> a bit crappy. You're going to see it later. No, it's not. I, I, oh, right. Okay. That's right. really cool. So what I went for, I actually can remember talking to you on Instagram about this. Yes. And, what, and you suggested what, flames. I did. Yeah. I know that I haven't got flames, mm. but I, <laughs> I mean, flames would have been cool. Yeah, I they would, like, like, they would have been look. really cool. Mm. I'm not that cool. So I've got, <laughs> I've got a hammer, an aeroplane, and a cactus. Amazing. Very nice touch. So at Cheshire Oaks, these are quite heavily discounted. It's quite an expensive bag. I think this was just over £200, so definitely an investment piece, but it's holding up really well, so mm. it's one that I'm hoping to have for a number of years. Definitely. Definitely. I kind of, I really am very jealous. Mine, mine isn't so nice. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> Let's have um, a look. Yeah, right, okay, so. Mine is again a backpack. Um, we are big believers in backpacks, aren't yeah. we? Especially being in London, um, it's nice to have your hands free on both. I think like yeah, a carry true. bag or like yeah. a shoulder bag just doesn't work. It's kind of yeah. both hands ready to go, ready to grab on the bus when you're gonna fall over, that kind of thing. Um, so mine- you're filming. Yeah, this is true. This is very <laughs> true, one hand vlogging. Um, so my backpack is by Rims. Um, and it was in Urban Outfitters in the sale. It was like 30 pounds, so it's quite- What? Yeah, it was, they retail, oh. they retail for about 70. That's really um, good. But yeah, it's waterproof as well. So I cycle around London now, so having a waterproof bag keeps everything inside completely safe. And it's kind of like got a safety flap as well. So like, if someone tries to get in your bag, they can't, which is brilliant. Um, I just love it. It's really, it's really nice. The straps don't look so comfortable. I'll show you from the back. They don't look the best. Like they're made out of this like, almost like fake leather, but um, they are solid and I've had absolutely zero complaints. And it's been going strong for like a year now. That's good. And I love it. Yeah, is that pocket there? Yeah, exactly. Oh no, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> it, it, would, it would be good if it was. I was like, oh no. But there is a pocket. Yeah, there's a secret the back pocket. Yeah. yeah, I'll show you guys what's in there in a bit, but it's like a, a back pocket. So when you're wearing it on your back, no one can get access to it at all. So it's, it's a pretty safe, solid, Backpack that I, yeah, it's, 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 it's decent. I really like it. I like the sleek yeah, design of it. It's very like Scandi minimal. Yeah. And, but now I, I want yours. And it goes with your bike. I think it's a, it's definitely it's, a bike. Yeah, it is. It's a bike yeah. backpack, definitely. Functional, yet yeah, nice. Yeah. That's what <laughs> so we like. Yeah, they're very true. Very true. Right, should we have a rummage? Yeah, you go for it. Absolutely. So I've got this. <laughs> I just bought this because we were filming. Necessity. Yeah. Do you use this? I do. I do. Yeah. It's strong stuff. It's very strong mm. and good for a windy, wet and windy day like today. Mm. Which it's is the, it's been um, both, yeah. Yeah, shorts have got to be glued hairspray. Mm. This bag, so I Ooh. got this is actually a wash bag, but I've just got that to actually keep my camera in. Because I, wow, I couldn't okay. find a camera bag. That's brilliant. So I thought you were going to whip out some kind of like kit or yeah, something. No, it's brilliant. just got my camera. Mm, protects which it. Is there, there at the moment. Makes so. perfect sense. What brand is it? I don't know. I think I, just, I can't even remember. That's lovely. It I think it came with like a gift set of some mm. sort of it's leather. Mm. It's nice. It's really nice. Oh F. what's that? F. I don't recognise that. I don't. No. <laughs> it will not be linked below. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely not. That's there. They're, they're good two solid two items. Absolutely. Should we have a look in yours now? Yes. So I guess we'll start with the back bit. Um, so this is where I keep generally my wallet. Um, this is just like a regular zip wallet from um, Zara. I got it like 
That's like nice. Two, yeah, it's two. I like the way the cards are on the front. This is it. So I wanted something that was really streamlined and small, um, that has a zip as well, because I, as we so rightly found out, I've got 33 pence in there. <laughs> so literally, I'd never carry change, so I don't know why I've got that. I have a completely separate card holder. Um, but Who is it that doesn't carry cash? The queen. I mean, yeah, because she doesn't need to, does yeah. she? Well, this is it. Well, but yeah. I am essentially the queen, <laughs> and I also have an Allen key in there um, for my bike. So yeah, that's that's what I keep in oh, there. Oh, that's handy. Yeah, it's good. Um, so that's the first item. Nothing else in there. Oh no, here's the Allen key. <laughs> I was not joking. Never get caught up with that man. Yeah. yeah. A little tip there. Do a bit of flat pack furniture while you're at it. Absolutely. Why not? I mean, who who doesn't love a bit of flat pack? <laughs> No, I do. This is true. <laughs> right, do you want to go? Uh, yeah. I've got an umbrella. Standard. Standard. Mm. I've got sunglasses. These are just top man ones. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Why do they keep doing that? I mean, do you I, ever do that? Sometimes they like fold in. I don't understand how they do. No. That. I like that. They're cool. <laughs> They're really They're nice. Very smeary. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Who doesn't have dirty sunglasses? It's always the case. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice. And we are getting man. a little bit of sun. Yeah, top man, they're like twelve pounds or something. I I am never been a big believer in investing in a lot of sunglasses until recently. I just think because I smash and lose and yeah. drop so many pairs until I got some and I was like, oh god, and then, like I'm scared to wear them. <laughs> do you find you look after them now? You know, I do. Yeah, yeah, you sort of have to, don't you? It's true. Very true. Indeed. <laughs> What else have you got? Yeah, okay, so um, as I was saying, I carry quite a lot. So in the first little zip bit, so the good thing about this has got a lot of compartments. So I don't know if you guys can see, but like there's a little slot here. And I just carry some like random bits of junk. So I've got some Carmex lip balm because I don't go anywhere without this because it's cold and literally this solves your life. Um, a pen, just because who doesn't need yeah. a pen? It's like a classic good every bag should have. And some intense recovery E45 hand cream Ooh. because I am a granddad and get really dry hands. <laughs> and it's like, it's the most intense stuff, so you use like the littlest bit. That's and like, a good one. Yeah, it's, it's well, it looks good. I mean, like E45, my whole family swears by it. And like, just take it. Yeah, just absolutely go for it. Try it before you buy. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't really have a smell to it, it's just like. That's quite good though, oh, isn't it? Especially, <laughs> especially if you're eating. Exactly, yeah. And it's just nice, yeah, it just it does intensely moisturize your hands. and kind of reduces the need to like reuse it over and over again. Do you know what I think causes it? Mm. Hand dryers. True. I blame them. Absolutely Because you don't dry those bits mm. properly then you end up with... And anti back as well. Antibacterial yes. completely absorbs a lot of oil on your hands. Mm. Oh, good to go. Yeah, you've got to go now. You're fully, fully locked and loaded. I've got an old school diary. Ooh. Do you use one of these? Do you know what I used to? And then this year I made a resolution to put it on my phone. Really? Mm. And I, I can't see. part with it. Mm. I just, yeah, I still need one. I like to sort of see it all written down yeah. still. Yeah, absolutely. The phone oh, you've got still a lot in there. Me. Wow. Busy man. You are a very busy man. Okay. <laughs> Shooting these videos. Literally, yeah. Wow, I like that as well. It's quite classy. It's like a nice little. Yeah. Mm, lovely. Um, card factory. No. <laughs> I would guess like, like 59p or something. Wow. Yeah. Bargain. Yeah, what a steal. Mm. These are things that I would lose as well, so true. I wouldn't invest in a diary particularly. Mm. Very true. Yeah. So this Ooh. pouch, this is from Muji. Right. And this I keep my passport in and stuff when I'm travelling. Okay. So I don't know why, but this it just makes it so handy. Mm. I can't really explain it. Mm. I've got earplugs in there as well. Brilliant. See, I actually carry earplugs. No, you know what I used to. Um, it can be such a lifesaver. Yeah, absolutely. But that's handy though, so it all doesn't go like rummaging around your bag. Yeah, that's it. it. Yeah, and you can put other things in there as well. Mm. There's receipts, I think. Mm. But yeah, definitely. But wow. it's sturdy because it's metal. It's about to say, yeah. yeah. Very, very good. I like that. Excellent. Well, keeping in theme with your um, your little pouch, I too carry one. I feel like we're very organised people. I'm not gonna lie. I think we're quite organised. Yeah, mine's a little bit more compact and a bit oh, more Oh, this looks good. Again, good for airports. Can you take that one through security? I bet yeah, you yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's kind of got some, yeah. But um, yeah, it's it's essentially got like this. If I never left the house with this, I'd be like a little bit, ugh, yeah. you know? It's just like, it's good for obviously security. Um, and I'm just gonna quickly go through what's in there because there's a lot of blister plasters, a must in London. When they are a must anywhere. Yeah, they're well used, I think I've got like two left. I just had to buy plus on my last holiday because yeah. I've got blood on my heels. <laughs> nice! <laughs> <laughs> Lovely bit of detail for you there. Sorry. But yeah, they, these are alright, boots, blister plasters. They're not amazing, but they're good and essential. Um, I have two kinds of hand wipes because I'm a little bit of a germ for. Um, tissues. 
Yeah. Self-explanatory. No sniffing, please. True, very true. A little travel-sized bottle of aftershave. This one's Invictus because Ooh. I don't like hurrying, you know, the big bottles. Yeah. Um, that's again, nice. really grubby, but yeah, been battered around. But Oh, it's nice. Yeah, it's good. That's very nice. Mm. Yeah, it's just nice rather than carrying a glass bottle that might smash and break. Pack of a mm. It's good. I'm into my scent, so that's that's a nice effect. Yeah. It's, it's done. Did you buy that or was that the in a set? set? Yeah, 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 brilliant. But you can buy them and get them filled up, which is brilliant. Um, so if you buy a big bottle, just go to the store. Um, some the Body Shop Strawberry Hand Gel because again, germs. Um, some extra chewing gum. I think I've got about four pieces left in that. Always good. Um, uh, this is going to make you laugh. A lip roller. Oh, classic. Spot the Instagrammer. <laughs> <laughs> so whenever you want to get that outfit shot and you, yeah. you've got lint all over you, this yeah. is a mini one. I'm a bit obsessed with them. Like, Where's that from? H&M. Oh, yeah. a set of two yeah. for like a pound. Do you know I've never like, actually owned a lint roller. I mean, no, I don't know why. Change your life. Can I just I mean, it? by all means, take the outer cotton on it. I'll let you... What? Oh, so it's sticky. Mm. And you just... Yeah, yeah, exactly. You've got it. Yeah. See? That does actually work. Mm. Why didn't we do this revolution? <laughs> <Sorry about that. laughs> like a preparation yeah. dream, isn't it? That's really yeah. good. Yeah, and again, just it's, yeah. it fits in. That's good. Um, and then last few things, a power bank. This is a lifesaver again. I always run out of battery. It's an iPhone problem. Um, so yeah, this has about five chargers in. When I remember the charger. That's impressive. It's really good. So it's it was two from... USBs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Um, so you literally can charge multiple devices or be that friend who's like, can I lend you power bank? You're like, yeah. You'd always so, be popular with one of them. Very true. Very true. I am um, also do carry an iPhone cable in here, but it's currently charging my phone. Um, so yeah, power bank. And then the last thing is just another little mini bottle of like a sample aftershave. I think this one's Hugo Boss or Lynx. Yeah, just a little. Lynx. Lynx. Lynx yeah. aftershave. Lynx aftershave is a thing. But yeah, just a nice Who little saviour. London survival kit, that's what I call it, my survival yeah, kit. Yeah, I'm impressed by that. You mm. are very organised. I try to be. <laughs> <laughs> I've also, I think in my front pocket here, got some of those kind of things. Mm. I would say on a, si oh, just it up. Oh. <laughs> on, a <laughs> on a similar theme. So I carry these. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> these I get in Lidl. And these are multi-surface cleaning wipes. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because you know when you get on the train and you put the tray table down, and it's, and it's like when it's yeah. oh god, and, and it's you're on that train for two and, hours. Yeah, and yeah. And there's a hair or something that mm -hmm. makes you want to gag. Yep. So I, I just carry them now. Mm. I've got a lot of tablets. Oh god, it's okay. Yeah. So you want to tell me? <laughs> yeah. They're all they're all ibuprofen. Right. I don't know why they end up in here like this. Mm. The M and S cutlery. Ah oh, wow. Okay. Something I never think of ever. Would and you that, find no, that useful in your bag? So much so. I can't tell you the amount of times that's uh, saved me on yeah, the train. Yeah, absolutely. I've had to use... Especially when you've picked up your porridge from Pret and you've forgotten your spoon you forgot and you get spoon. on the train you're like... Yeah. You know what? I thought I was organised. That's genius. <laughs> absolutely genius. It's too many, too many hours on the train, true. seriously. And I've got a pocket cleanse tea bag. This would be good for you. Very true. I don't know why I've got that. Kick in the cafe and you can donate that, I'm telling you. <laughs> Is that everything in there? Yeah, that's in the front pocket. Wow, okay. We carry on. Uh, yeah. I don't know what this is. Oh, this is where I keep, if I'm on shoots for a client, I keep the cash in there. Right. Simple as that. Simple as that. That's yeah. literally self It's empty now. Oh, yeah. no dollar. <laughs> Lockets. Another essential. Yeah. Couldn't agree more. There's nothing worse than having a cough and being that person who continually coughs. Yeah. Yeah. I've got quite a lot more, so I'm going to go now and delve deep into the back. Um, this oh, is, it's a new compartment. Yeah, this is... It's, we're going right in. We're going right in. This is a bit you're going to laugh. So, <laughs> so being a foodie, um, I carry a magazine with me at all times. This is a new um, Waitrose March edition. Oh, yeah, that um, looks good. It's good. I haven't had a chance to read it. I literally picked it up this morning. But I think just having some kind of like reading material yeah. is never a bad thing. This one's quite thin and streamlined as well, so it just fits in. But I love Waitrose magazine. Um, so yeah, flick. absolutely. As you can see, I have a collection of them to my uh, to my right there. This actually looks like a good. <laughs> it's read. brilliant. It's fantastic. It's got like some travel in it. But Any like food photographers out there or people who like recipes or editorial, definitely pick up a Waitrose magazine. It's two pound to anyone who isn't a member, or you can get a little club card for free and pick it up when you're next in. It's brilliant. Recipes good. Yeah, really good. Yeah, absolutely, and so detailed. Five things to do in March. There we are. Yeah, so mm. it's like an actual magazine. Mm. Very I mean, cool. it's not aimed at a twenty-year-old student at any means, but it's still brilliant. <laughs> yeah, I love it. See, I, my guilty pleasure is the little magazine. Is it? Seen that? Yes. I didn't know that. <laughs> and oh. it's full of like 
tools or things, you know, like middle aisles. Absolutely. I'll pick that up next time. I like, I like to have a, a little flick through that. Brilliant. But, but yeah. this is like the, the creme de like creme, the creme it? It of is. a supermarket mag. Mm, it's pretty good. I mean, that's what they charge. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then my last thing is, uh, last thing, last thing in that pocket um, is my laptop. So this is just what I keep it in. It's by um, a brand called Harbour, Harbour London. It's just nice and thin and streamlined again. Um, and it just keeps my Mac in. It's got the 13-inch uh, MacBook, it goes everywhere I go. Um, it's battered, it's worn, bruised. It's probably gonna give up very soon, but it's my baby, and this probably gives me a lot of backache and cycling with a laptop. In do you literally carry it everywhere, do you? I carry it everywhere I go. Yeah, I have a screen yeah. in my room, um, and then my laptop goes with me. Yeah, everywhere I go, it goes. I should give it a name, really. I should treat it with more stickers. care. Yeah, sticker it off, but yeah, that's... It's the two thin items that go towards the back, so it rests against my back, so it's not too bad. But yeah, a bit excessive, but... <laughs> Can you guys give Luke's laptop a name in the comments, please? Yeah, that, that's a good shout. Nothing rude. They do come up with really good stuff. Do they? Okay. Yeah. Right, exciting. <laughs> I'll, I'll refresh the comments every yeah. now and then. Yeah. <laughs> Great, okay, um, carry on. Charger for my... Ooh. Ooh. And headphones. This always Camera happens. Camera charger, headphones, yeah. needs some... Sort now. <laughs> yeah. I've got a, oh this is a, I was at the airport and you know when you spray the cards. Ooh, nice. Can you still smell it? Yeah. Do you know wow. what that is? Can you tell what that is? I've never had a dip tea product. That ever. is fig, the fig one. Fig yeah. and a rolly or something, or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Mm. That's the main compartment. I don't carry an awful lot. Usually my laptop would be in here, but it's mm. not always in here, if that mm. makes sense. I okay. don't, yeah. But you can just squeeze it into the back, but it's oh, a yeah, squeeze. That's cool. yeah. You get it in that bit, oh, if brilliant. you wanted to. Mm. I like your uh, laptop bag. Do you? Yeah. Yeah, they're, 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 a, they're a good good solid brand. They're London based as well. Oh, are they? Mm. Yeah, they're, they're great. This is a hair product, Fish. Do you use this ever? Fish, I've heard of Fish. Yeah, they're yeah. good. Mm. Good size. Yeah, just a travel size. Mm. Um, just for those emergencies. <laughs> emergencies when you need to sort your hair out. Yeah. I've been in them many a time. Yeah. Mm. Absolutely. Um, once I sat down to shoot a video and I, put no, and I had literally put nothing in my hair. Really? And I got to the end, yeah. And, and I was, realized, yeah. oh no. <laughs> I've been there myself. And it wasn't a good look, trust mm, me. Yeah. Uh, my wallet, mm. this is old. This is Aspinall and it's I never uh, recognized the print. Yeah, it's like, they. I think they still do this print, right? They do. This is quite old, so it's a- It's a classic. It's a classic. It's really good because it's got this separate bit in here, so you can take this bit out. And ah. this is like a, a separate card um, holder, and you can put your Oyster card in that bit as Brilliant. well. Brilliant! I do love a so, multi-functional yeah. product. Yeah. And if you if you don't want like a bulgy pocket, just pop that in. Brilliant! It's like the yeah. two in one. Yeah. yeah, that's kind of like my. Or you could setup, yeah. even do half and half. You've got a yeah. holiday, put how euros like in this? there. I think probably like ten years. And look how well it's worn. Yeah, I mean, Aspinall yeah. products are just. Fantastic, true. And that with the white and everything, the stitching is all good still. Fantastic, and, yeah. yeah. So again in the zip, I forgot to mention, um, again, Aspinall, I'm sticking with it. This Ooh. is, it's a bit newer um, than yours, but it's still a very loved item. This is kind of like a similar card wallet. Um, I've got it embossed with my initials, I don't know if you can see, the LC. Um, That's really nice. Yeah, it's lovely. Did it's they like, do that in the store? Yeah, the one in um, Covent Garden. Nice. Really it's lovely. Like snake skin. Though. Exactly, yeah. Design. But this is kind of like my primary wallet, if you know what I mean. Yeah. So the zip one I showed you earlier stays in my backpack, but if I ever nip out, like if I have this, I'm sound. So it's got, um, yeah, I think if I cover that. So this is where my Oyster card would be. And then these are where like my bank cards, real card, driving license, that kind of thing. So as long as I've got this, I'm pretty set to go. So yeah, Aspinall. That's going to last you. Love you. It will. It was pricey, it was like £70. Yeah. But when you think about use, how often yeah. you replace your wallet, it's pretty good. I think especially if it's something you use every day. Absolutely. It's like, absolutely. It's and that, that gets to bashed at the Oyster reader every time, like yeah. tapping away, so yeah, it's good. Very Amazing. nice. Yeah. Oh, do you have any more? I'm just digging now. Oh, I've got a concealer. Oh, yes. Mm. It's so. Sometimes you just need it, don't you? Are you somebody who uses a bit of concealer? I always, yes. I have still terrible skin, even in my early 20s, so yeah. <laughs> it doesn't go, oh. trust me. Great news. <laughs> <laughs> well, it hasn't with me. Mm. But um, yeah, this is a concealer from, it's a cheap one from Superdrug, um, but it just does the job. Mm. It will cover up a spot or in, in tie those bags in those emergencies. Mm. I've also got a hand sanitizer. This one is stress relief 
and it's from Bath and Body Works. Did you get that in America? Yeah. Right, okay, yeah. that's lasted you a while. So it's last legs, but yeah, I picked that up in New York. Now this, I swear by. Ooh. Have you tried this? This is Vicks First Defense. Is it a nasal spray? Yeah. Okay. But it's for if somebody coughs near to you or sneezes in your face or right. is germy, mm. you, and you feel like you've breathed their germs in, mm. you just shove this up your nose and breathe it all in and it kills any of the nastiness. No way. So it's a really good one if wow. you just think you've been too close to somebody that's been a little bit ill. Good in the winter months, I imagine. Yeah, that's it, yeah. Mm. Brilliant. Good, good solid um, bag item that is. I might invest. You've convinced yeah. me now on cutlery and first defense. Cutlery. It's two things. <laughs> yeah. Basically, I'm blind, so should wear glasses, but don't. Oh really? Um, yeah, absolutely. What are you doing with um, cycling? This is really funny. I squint. Do you? Squint like that. So you're short sighted. Mm, I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like reading things like that. I'm fine when I wake up, but then I have something called like rapid deterioration where your eyesight throughout the day gets worse and worse. So um, these glasses are by uh, Glasses Direct. Highly recommend them. Um, I'm going to put them on for the purpose of this video. I quite like these frames. They're like um, a bit retro. Which Those like, are really nice. Nice, aren't they? Yeah. yeah, and they're like 20 pounds. Again, very dirty. <laughs> um, but yeah, quite quite nice. Quite a nice little fit. And the good thing with Glasses Direct as well is that you can um, try them on, like the contacts, um, the frames, and if you like them, they fit your prescription in. So it's kind of like try before you buy. It's so cool. But it's good because obviously when you order glasses online, you don't want them to be like them. Yeah. Anymore. So yeah, carry those. Um, and this is what I was saying about sunglasses. So these are Ray-Bans, I got these for my 20th birthday, and so they're a nice treat, but I am scared to wear these. Mm -hmm. They're just the classic Wayfarer, um, I think they're called Clubmaster or something, I think that's what they're called. Um, they're nice. Oh god, everything's just gone dark. <laughs> <laughs> they are really nice, um, but they're just, yeah, I kind of like wear them and then take them off and then immediately put them back into the pouch, because I just think one day I'm probably going to scratch them, and then I'll cry or leave them on a train, or both. But Pretty yeah, nice. carry both of those with Is me. Is that solid, that pouch? Ish. Yeah. Yeah. And squashing it with mm. it. Yeah. Yeah, but I think, like, if you invest in a good quality pair of sunglasses that are going to protect you from, like, the UV rays, then yeah. go right about there. And they're another thing that you can wear every day throughout the Yeah, season. absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. They're a, they're a nice present. Yeah, definitely. So, yeah, that was that. My keys. Always. <laughs> oh, you've got a My Way Choice card as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So I'll get, be able to get that magazine. Get one of these, yeah. You can get a free magazine and a free coffee or tea. And a Tesco Club card on there. Always. <laughs> wow. Here we are. You're getting to know everything here. This is inspirational, mm. I know. Mm. And there's a pen. Mm. Plasters. Uh, that's the hotel I just stayed in, just their card. I've got a miniature uh, L'Occitane aftershave here. Very nice. I've got a L'Occitane aftershave. Wow. Cologne Cedrat. Cedrat. Very nice. Yeah, I didn't, um, I just kept that in there because, yeah, oh, it's fresh. Wow. Okay. Mm. Lots of send do amazing products. Yeah. They really do. My mum swears by them. She Does she? Yeah, I like their shampoo. Mm. Yeah. Very, um, very nice, mate. Chewing gum. Mm. Tags that I just cut straight off a shirt because I wanted to wear it immediately. Brilliant. I was impatient. Mm. And... I've got just like a load of change of like euros and pound coins. Mm. You're I just, a well-travelled man. <laughs> it's because I don't it's like it in well. my pockets or um, I don't have a wallet with like a zip section mm. so I, it just ends up in my bag. Brilliant. Yeah. I think that's it. Is that everything? Yeah. Wow, well, you weren't joking. You don't carry a lot, do no. you? No. Very minimal. Your pile compared to mine is um, it's a bit ridiculous. I've still got a bit left to go. Should I, should I carry on? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, um... Oh, I've got more chewing gum, which is, uh, again... Airwaves. Yeah, airwaves, classic. A water bottle. This is really nice. Do you carry nice. water? I do. You do, but not, not, you didn't bring any? No, mm. but there would often be, I've got like a travel mug, or um, sometimes I just fill up a water bottle. Yeah, 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 well I sometimes yeah. do carry like a thermos as well as yeah. this, which is, again, ridiculously excessive. But this is a thermos one that you can put hot or cold in. That's really good. Just came into my life. I usually just use it for water. It's by a brand called Ruffle, and they're just starting out, um, and they're brilliant, like really, really nice. It keeps it cold for hours. This is a nice oh, design that is as well. really cold still. Yeah. Is that this morning? Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. I just put British filter water in it. You can't call it a lot of liquid, so that's a bit of a shame, but it kind of encourages you to drink more. Yeah. Because if you go through it once, you're like, right, it's What's that, about a litre? Yeah, yeah, I'd say so. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. You can um, put soup in that. But this is true. Yeah, soup, coffee, or anything in between. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, I don't know what else there is. <laughs> um, Wine. Next, well, I, oh my God. Now we're onto something. Gin and tonic? Yes. <laughs> um, headphones. I used to use earphones, like the earbuds that you've mm -hmm. got. 
But um, after my doctor said don't use them because I have problems with my ears, I'm quite deaf in this ear actually. Really? Mm, fun fact. I'm so blind and deaf. Sat this way around. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. This is this is why I've sat your side. Yeah. Um, these are by Kit Sound. Super cheap, super affordable. But you literally just put them on, and they're quite noise cancelling. So like for the size of the actual um, ear drivers, they're pretty. Pretty good. They're Bluetooth as well, so no cable. Oh, that's cool. Mm, yeah. Would you go running in those? Yes, I, I use them for the gym, I use them for running. I don't use them while I'm cycling. I guess I could put them on the side and then helmet on top, but I really want some of those ear pods. Yeah. But then it's kind of putting them in my ear and I feel like my doctor will be watching me going, uh-uh. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, okay. headphones. Um, they don't go anywhere unless, uh, unless they aren't charged. Yeah, they come with me everywhere. Um, oh, actually, you know what? The last two things. I'm not far behind not you. Not too bad. Literally, yeah. Um, so I know I was like taking the mick out of you kind of about your diary, very yeah. old school. I carry a notepad. Oh yeah. And like it shows how well used it is. Look at your handwriting. It's a bit ridiculous. Show them your handwriting. I, can you, I don't know, I just want to see if there's anything oh, on yeah, sorry. <laughs> These are just Thank like you. notes of um, like a lecture that I did. <laughs> but like I'm nearly, to, is that? I'm nearly towards the end, look like it's actually nearly done. But I've had this for about, as you can see, it's a bit dishevelled and battered and yeah, but I've had this for quite a while, and I just take it everywhere I go. Because I do like the Notes app on, you know, like your iPhone. Oh yeah, I use that a lot. Yeah, yeah, but I just think sometimes it's nice to just grab a pen, have like a coffee or a hot drink, and then just yeah. like start writing. Yeah. It's quite therapeutic, isn't it? It is, yeah. Sometimes I just like journal a day, or just write some stuff, but yeah. And nice. do you have a to-do list? Oh, look how excessive I am. I am a very much a tick box, I don't know if you guys can see. He draws the boxes. Draws the boxes. Yeah. It's just so that. satisfying to yeah. like tick things off and be like, Done, yeah. done, 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 and oh, that wasn't a very successful. Oh, this is actually something I need to do. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm halfway through. This is a business plan I have to do for uni, so <laughs> it's somewhat there. But um, yeah, no pad. And then my last thing was something I was telling you about earlier. Oh yes. Um, so I am all about reading material. Again, very old school. Don't have an iBook. I have a yeah. real one. I like the smell. I like the physicality of it. I just like holding it. But this is the Miracle Morning, and it's by Hal Erold. Um, I'm about a fifth of the way through, so I've still got that much to go. It's basically about how to transform your morning before 8am. Six habits that can just kickstart your day. And I've been struggling with like waking up recently and feeling productive and feeling like I need to get stuff done. And this is actually helping loads. It's it's brilliant. I would highly recommend. When I'm done, you can give it a read. I will. If I'm you feel try like, it. Yeah, if you're feeling like changing your morning, then give it a go. That's what do you do? What are you using uh, your time for? What well, these five AM starts? Five AM starts activities. Gym. I have joined a gym, which is which is good. I'm quite it's proud. Um, it's, yeah. it's something I've been wanting to do for ages. And I think like if you can't find time in your day, chances are if you have your morning, take an hour off um, your sleep, but have an hour extra at night, and then it works out. You aren't losing yeah. sleep. You know, yeah. I used to go to bed around eleven. Now I'm going to bed around half past nine, ten, waking up at five, and it works. I'm still getting solid seven hours and feel more productive. Yeah. And you're not tired? Not tired? We're filming this at uh, nearly half five. Mm, half five. How are you, you feeling? I feel knackered. Do you? <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> that's because he's been around me all day. I'm a tyrant person. It's exhausting, me. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, that's that's everything. We, you know what? Our piles aren't too... We're looking down, by the way, and we're seeing because we've just been yeah. chucking everything. It's um, Made a mess of your floor. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. <laughs> not, not bad. Can I just say, how nice is Luke's room? Oh, stop it. Have a look. <laughs> look at this yeah. wall. It's, um, so I know that you guys will really appreciate this. Mm. It's 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 all right. Yeah, it's, it's a little it's bit really of really nice. So obviously there's like a lot of Luke's room here that you can't see, but definitely go and have a look at his room tour. I'm going to link it below because honestly this space is amazing. I'm just looking around <laughs> and it's like everywhere you look, it's just so cool. He's oh, done it. Thank you. Babe. Very very nice. This is only <laughs> like a snippet of it. So it's a bit. definitely go and have a look. <laughs> Um, and over on Luke's channel as well, we are going to do our favourite fragrances. Yeah. So I'm going to link that video below as mm -hmm. well, and please go and check it out and make sure you hit subscribe while you're over there because he makes some amazing videos. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Comment below on what you keep in your bag so we can have a read of um, anything that we might have missed, things that we should be carrying about day to day. Mm -hmm. And I will see you very soon. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. <laughs> no, don't. <laughs> no, I'm no. about to ramble. <laughs> we won't go there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, you're making me laugh. <laughs> um, yeah, I haven't. <laughs> no, no, let's not talk about Brexit. <laughs> I'm going to please stop. <laughs> 
Um, so I um, also I'll take a shower. But it's basically just how to transform your morning. Transform? Trans. Brilliant. For one seventy-five, one dollar seventy-five. Something That's like quite that. good. Yeah, you get good. Oh, so it says on there. Yeah, I read it. You like something? I don't know. It is. <laughs> I'm sure there's like there was an offer. You know, you get like you fill a basket. Three for two. Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Mm, yeah. It was like ten. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to go over to his channel, um, we are shooting a. What are we doing? A top four? Three. I feel like we both said plasters, it sounds really posh. Plasters? Yeah, I don't say plasters. Do you not? No. Do oh. you, you don't either. Plasters, yeah. You say plasters. Did I say plasters? Because yeah. I've been around here all day. <laughs> Do you think that's what it is? Yeah, it is. <clears throat> but if I say plasters, that sounds really odd, doesn't it? It sounds like how I'd see it. Yeah. Plasters. Okay, what should I say? Plasters. <laughs> Band-Aids. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh my dear. Do you know what? Like, I am surprised. Like, seeing it all out, you're like, oh god. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot. <laughs>